Swami, why are those people dressed like that? Those people are dressed in their traditional clothes, which shows their different cultures. Culture? What does that mean? Culture is a people's way of life. Mommy, what is it all about? Culture has to do with the way a group of people behave. This includes the food they eat, the way they dress, and the language they speak among others. Everyone belongs to a particular cultural group. In Nigeria, we have numerous cultural groups, but the three biggest cultural groups are Igbo, Hausa, and Yoruba cultural groups. The Yoruba people live in the southwestern part of Nigeria. They are the main people in Lagos, Ogun, Oyo, Oshun, Ondo, Kwara, and Ekiti states in Nigeria. They are also found in some parts of Edo and Kogi states. The Igbo people live in the southeastern part of Nigeria. They live mostly in Anambra, Imo, Enugu, Abia, Eboi, and some parts of rivers and delta states in Nigeria. The Hausa people are found in the northern parts of Nigeria. Some of the states they occupy in Nigeria are Niger, Kano, Kaduna, Sokoto, Bauchi, Adamawa, Jigawa, Gombe, Nasarawa, and Taraba. There are two types of culture, material and non-material culture. Material culture refers to the physical things in our culture, things that we can see and touch. Parts of culture that are material are houses, food and clothes. For example, when it comes to food, the Hausa people are known to eat Tuo Shinkafa and Tuo Mascara. Yoruba people eat Amala and Eforiro and the Igbo people eat Akbu and Nsala soup. People also dress differently in the various cultures. For example, in the Yoruba culture, Men traditionally wear buba and shokoto or agbada and the women put on buba and iro. In the Hausa culture, men wear babariga and the women put on wrapper called abaya with matching blouses and head ties. And lastly, in the Igbo culture, men put on ishago and wrapper. Do you know the culture you're from? Can you tell the type of food that people in your culture eat? You can ask your parents to tell you more. Talking about non-material culture. These are parts of culture that are not physical. We cannot see and touch them. Parts of cultures that are non-material are language, belief and values. People in different cultures speak different languages. In Nigeria, the people from the three major cultural groups can be identified by the different languages they speak. We can also see different forms of religious beliefs such as Christianity, Islam and traditional worshippers. There are also values things that people consider as right and wrong across the major cultural groups. I hope you now understand what culture is all about. Now, let's do a little fun exercise. It's question time. Question 1. What is culture? Option A. Culture is what people believe in. Option B. Culture is a people's way of worship. Option C. Culture is a people's way of life. Option D. Culture is the way people dress. The correct answer is option C. Culture is a people's way of life. Question 2. The two types of culture are Option A. 
living and non-living culture. Option B, material and non-material culture. Option C, old and new culture. Option D, material and immaterial culture. The correct answer is option B, material and non-material culture. Question 3. Which of these is an example of material culture? Option A. Language. Option B. Food. Option C. Values. Option D. Believe. The correct answer is option B. Food. That's all for now. See you next time. Bye-bye.